a video by black unicorn fan fictions if you copy you will have hair on your peaches it's a shrub curse i'm cleaning tayung's office room he sleeps in this room most of the times nothing is organized in the bookshelf currently he's on a business trip and will be back in evening we got married few months ago and he was my boss best friend um still is one day he asked me out and i couldn't deny because um how can i deny to a free chocolate cake when i know that i can only afford candies just kidding i love myself and no one deserves me i kept on organizing things suddenly a diary caught my eyes it seems it's his personal diary should i invade in his privacy why not we are married and there is no privacy between husband and wife we share same bed daily i opened it and started reading there is no date mentioned on it but he has written a lot about his crush there are lot of love letters in it why didn't he give it to her maybe she returned them there are lot of pictures of her it seems like he had taken them secretly she's gorgeous his all the poetry is very funny but heart touching but someone has written improve your handwriting in the last page as per my assumptions he gave this diary to her and she returned it after rejecting him or break up i don't know if she was his crush or ex I can never someone like the way I love you written on the last page. I felt uncomfortable after reading this line. It seems like he used to be very expressive but now his nature is cold. He rarely expresses himself through words. I remember clearly that he wanted to get married fast because of his family pressure. Negative thoughts started doing belly dance in my kidneys. I left the room unorganized and unclean and kept the diary where it was. I have to attend his friend's birthday party with him tonight. In evening he entered in the house and gave me a faint smile i kept a poker face because i am mentally disturbed we have to talk a lot kim taeyong but after party what happened is your stomach upset did you eat tan's biscuit again yes i did it once because i wanted to see how does it taste like i'm fine i'm so tired gave him a glass of juice it seems like you aren't happy to see me you shouldn't assume everything on your own wait but that's what i am doing whatever get ready for the party we will go to shopping mall first to buy something for him i'm going to take a bath he went to bathroom and i successfully made him uncomfortable with my gaze how immature i am who cares i applied lipstick and took off my wedding ring i'm in a mood of drama i took his stuff back in the room and found a pink paper bag maybe it's for jin he came out of the bathroom why and there is a pink paper bag in my stuff that's for you i happily opened it and found a jacket it's beautiful i didn't get much time for shopping that's all i could get it's all right i'm forgiving you this time tell me why are you mad at me no i'm not eat some acidity medicines you will feel better after farting a bit my stomach is fine we came to shopping mall and he bought a perfume for his friend and me now how can i believe that stupid diary He never fails to tickle the dragon flies of my intestine. Do you want to buy something? No, let's go. How handsome he is. This girl doesn't look good with him. Maybe she is his maid or assistant. Pretended to fall and stepped on her foot. Oh, my mistake. She hissed in pain because of Wyan's heels. Are you dumb? That wasn't intentional. We are sorry. Didn't you hear what she say? what i was looking towards gucci store happy birthday hugged him and gave the gift thank you so much please have a seat no we will roam around and eat food okay please enjoy went to another guest i am sitting for a while my feet hurts do you need my shoes i am wearing a red gown and i will look like a post walks after wearing black shoes as you say let me get something for you He gave me a plate of food and went towards his another friend. Suddenly someone approached me. "Hey, I wasn't expecting you here. It's been long. You have changed. Continue your line and say that you are looking gorgeous." I stopped telling lies. Me and Jake used to study together and he was college heartthrob. So you need an eye surgery. By the way, what are you doing here? Waiting for everyone to finish the food so that I can do the dishes later. Ha ha ha. Hmm. I always knew that you are a very ambitious person. I'm glad to know that you are doing well in your life, but I have more work for you. No, I'm fine with this one. You know that I'm very straightforward. Well, I never focused on you, so I don't know. Wanna go out with me? 
How much out do you want to go? We are on the terrace of this hotel. You are dumb like always. My heels are reaching. Bring your foot forward. Sorry, you're forgiven. I'm asking you for a date. Came towards them and cleared his throat. Let's go home, Wyant. You have a boyfriend? She's my wife. Oh, I'm sorry. She isn't wearing a ring. So I thought she's single. They even glared at me after looking at my finger. Should I jump from here? I wasn't expecting this. Cuff, cuff. I'm feeling dizzy. I think we should go home. Bye. Hugged her and left. Ha <laughs> ha. Enjoyed? As soon as we came back to home, I ran towards my bedroom and put back my ring. He followed me with a poker face. Oh my name, Jesus. How can I forget to wear it? Why did you even remove it? I think it's time to reveal everything. Did you cheat on me? How can I? Yungi didn't come to our city yet. How shameless you are, cup syrup. I, wait a minute, went to his office room and came back with his diary. Explain this. You never said these kind of lines for me. You never expressed your feelings in words for me. You never wrote poetry for me. Why her? Wiped fake tears. You made me emotional. You gave me this diary. He took the diary and started laughing like mad cows while reading it. What? Clicked its spec and sent it to Jimin. See what did I find? I think you are supposed to tell everything to me. One day, me and Jimin fought over dumplings. And I stole his diary to blackmail him. I didn't know that it is still with me. So it's not yours? Hmm. I was doubting same because your handwriting is worse than him. She is Min Yoonji, his first love and now they are already married. Oh, I thought she was your ex or crush. By the way, you never told me about your past. I cannot count my ex-girlfriends on finger. So let's not talk about it. I am happy that I haven't cleaned your office room yet. Get out. I was just joking. I was very focused on my career. I never had time for all this. When I came to Jungkook's office, I saw you there and you matched my type. So I asked you out. Your type? Hot and intelligent? Dumb but cute. I think we should take divorce. Explain about the ring. I got mad at you after reading that diary so I want to do some drama. Are you mad at me? Who was that big? Jake, we used to study together in college. Nothing else. My dirty eyes are on you only. Good for you. Why don't you learn something from him? Jimin. I know more than him. Wanna see? I'm shy, but don't stop it today. Came closer to her. Are you? Harshly opened the door. Give that to me. I'm straight and loyal to Ian. He's talking about the diary. Snatched the diary. Thank God. How did you enter? Through balcony. Of course, by door. Do you know the password? I even know about his underwear size. You could have waited till tomorrow. I need to destroy this diary before my wife sees it. She's gonna make fun of me. You aren't supposed to enter in a married couple's room. At this time. Oh, I never thought about that. Enjoy guys, I'm leaving. I want to meet your wife. She's beautiful. Eyes on mine. Sure. I would like to invite me and her on dinner at your house tomorrow. Are you done?